Antony is no longer a certain starter under Eric Ten Hag at Manchester United. Eric Ten Hag has made his true feelings about Antony clear after naming the Brazilian on the Manchester United bench for the second successive game. Antony has been left out of the starting lineup five times in United's last seven games and isn't part of Ten Hag's strongest attacking trio. The Dutchman pushed to reunite with Antony after leaving Ajax to enter the Old Trafford hot seat in the summer of 2020. United eventually coughed up £86 million to recruit the 23-year-old winger, making him the club's second most expensive signing after the £89 million capture of Paul Pogba. However, Antony has failed to impress during his first year and a half in England, registering nine goals and four assists in 68 United appearances. His goal and assist against League 2 Newport County in the FA Cup fourth round were his only direct contributions in 24 games this season. In his program notes for Sunday's Premier League clash against West Ham United, Ten Hag hailed Antony for his involvement in the 4-2 win at Rodney Parade. Antony will take a big boost from scoring his first of the season, Ten Hag wrote. Since he also assisted Bruno's opener and looked a real threat throughout the game, I hope he will continue to grow in confidence and show us even more of his undoubted ability. Ten Hag's praise of Antony came before Thursday's dramatic 4-3 triumph against Wolves at Molyneux, though. And the struggling star did more damage than good after replacing Marcus Rashford in the 73rd minute. Antony took 16 touches, won 3 of 7 ground duels, lost the ball 6 times, completed just 2 of 4 attempted passes and failed 3 of 4 attempted take-ons. One of them launched the counter-attack that ended with Pedro Neto firing Wolves level in the 95th minute. Kabi Mainu, who has scored more goals in his last two games than Antony has all season, rescued the visitors with an incredible solo strike shortly after. Antony's bench role in five of the last seven matches suggests that Ten Hag no longer views him as a better option than Alejandro Garnacho, who is thriving on the right wing.